Avram receives guests graciously while in the city of Sodom it is the opposite. Whoever performs this mitzvah is threatened with death. Thus God decides to destroy Sodom, and Avram begs God to change his mind. Why does the Torah juxtapose these two events? Rav Kamenetsky responds that we see here the incredible greatness of Avram Avinu in his relationship with others. When a person excels in one area, they become very demanding of others in that same area. For example, one who has the habit of eating the fourth meal of Shabbos will tend to badly consider those who do not do this mitzvah. The man who attends tefillah punctually will view the latecomers with contempt, etc. But Avram did not fall into this trap, and despite his enormous kindness to the guests at his table, he does not judge the inhabitants of Sodom badly and even try to protect them. One should learn not to judge others badly in the areas where one succeeds and to remember also that the other person has strengths in other areas. The lesson of the week, like Avram Avinu, do not impose on others with your own requirements. Shabbat Shalom.